Nearly 300,000 Americans have rhinoplasty or a nose job every year, but it can be hard to figure out what size nose is best for your face. So Dr. O is backstage in our procedure room right now to show you the latest way to get a virtual nose job. That's right, Travis. You know, for me, this is 30 years that I've been doing rhinoplasty or nose jobs. And I would say the biggest thing that I get from patients is, but how am I going to look afterwards? And in this case, size matters. I've got some great technology that I'm going to use, the Vectra 3D imaging system, which allows me to actually do a virtual rhinoplasty or nose job for Linda. So Linda, tell me about your nose. What bothers you? Everything. I just, the profile is horrible, but my nostrils are too big. So is this, is this something you've thought about doing for oh, a while? For, since I was a little kid. Okay, well, you know, in looking at this nose, there are a couple of things. It, the nose just doesn't fit the rest of your face. And the biggest thing is we're seeing is the nose is over projected. The bridge is a little high and the angle of your nose is not quite right for a woman. So what we're going to do is we're going to start by deprojecting your tip. That's the single biggest thing that we want to do. You see how that's coming in closer to your face? Now, in general, I want the length of that nose to be the same as the length from the bottom of the nose to the upper lip. But now when we do that, your bridge looks too high, okay? Just straighten that br bridge, give you a bridge that fits your face a little bit better, something like that, all right? But the other point we made is that your, your nose, the angle of your nose is, is too straight. So we want to adjust that to give you a more elegant angle. See that coming up? See, that fits much, much better with your face. And then finally, you know, as we make this nose smaller, the net effect is going to make, is going to make your nostrils a little bit smaller. And that, that makes a huge difference on your nose. So let's take a look at the way you looked in profile before. You see that? So what have we done? We've taken that bridge in, we brought the nose in closer to the face, wow. rotated the nose, and in so doing, the, the nostrils become smaller. <laughs> but we're not done yet. Let's show you what we can do from the front, okay? So from the front, I think you see it, that your tip's a little wide and your bridge is a little bit wide. So number one, we want to we want to start with narrowing that tip like so. See that difference? Yeah. That makes a huge difference. And finally, we want to narrow the bridge as well so that that nose fits your face, something like that. So let's compare the two from the front, before and after. That's pretty Quite nice, different. right? <laughs> so we can, we can take you back through this, see those changes in different views in three quarters and taking us back to this, right? And then finally, we can morph this for you and we can show you, take you back. That this is your oh, old no. nose, oh, you God. see that? And then the final product that we've done for you to take you back to that, that's a Amazing. nose that fits your face.